Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you guys some DIYs that I used to make my room super cute and aesthetic. For the first one, I made Benny candles like I show in the picture, and I don't actually have a video of me making them, so I'm just going to show you the video I followed along to. For a couple bucks at the thrift store, and I'm finally doing it. I'm making the twisty ones. First, I filled the sink with hot water out of my tap. Once it was full, I threw my candles in and quickly panicked because I realized that they float, so I threw some spoons on them, and this worked. Kinda. After 10 minutes, I took my first noodle out. I flattened the middle with a water bottle, put it back in the water to keep it warm while I twisted it a couple of times, and then put it under cold water to lock it into place. The bendy ones were even easier. I just twisted them into curvy shape I wanted, ran them under cold water, and there you have them. This took me a grand total of 15 minutes, and I love my squiggly it wasn't quite that easy. Turns out you need to leave them for about 15 to 20 minutes, and I took them out way too early, so it broke, but I just super glued it back together. It's still super cute next to this other candle, which brings us to our next one, which is painting a candle. This one is also really easy, actually way easier. I just used my Posca pens, which I use for absolutely everything, 10 out of 10 recommend. So cute, did cow print, cause it'd be simple. Next one, just paint. Painting is so, it can be so aesthetic and it's really easy and it looks so good on your shelf. If you're going for a more preppy vibe, you can do this. And for the next one, I painted a mirror. You can also do this with like squiggly mirrors that you can find on Amazon. But yeah, again, just normal acrylic paints. I added some flowers and stars, and I think it looks so cute. Definitely recommend this one. You might have to do a couple layers, because it, it sometimes gets weird. I don't know. I only did like two or three, but it doesn't look too bad. So the next one, if you don't have a um, CD case... You can also just paint CDs, which I have a short of that on my channel, so definitely go check that out when you're done with this video. So for this one, I just printed out some pictures from Google that I wanted, and then taped them to the back with clear tape. You can also hang this on your wall, I just didn't have the materials to. So for the next one is a little jewelry container. I took a yogurt container and printed out a cute design, put it on with tape, and it looks so good. And I really needed it because I just had them. I just had my bracelets all over. The next one, a clay jewelry tray. This one definitely takes a lot more time. I had to find a tutorial for air dry clay. I don't include that here, but you can easily find tutorials on Google. Um, but yeah, and then I painted it with my Posca pens. It looks super good on my dresser and I love it. 